Right now we are featuring a well-known artist, a Greenville native who's been a major part of the art scene for decades. Rick Standridge founded the South Carolina Children's Theater in 1987 and has a hand in several, several other theaters, schools, and organizations, but he says he'll always be a visual artist. And we're glad to have Rick in studio right here ahead Thank of a you. big live painting event, July 27th and 28th, Dark Side of the Moon. We'll get into that, but welcome, glad you're here. Thank you, Margaret. We're delighted yeah, to be here. This is going to be great. You a lot of times paint in sync with music. It comes from your love of music and your synesthesia. Explain mm -hmm. synesthesia. Synesthesia is a sensory uh, input where uh, it's a psychological phenomenon, uh, Margaret, where one sensor in influences another. Mm -hmm. For instance, if, if somebody's hearing my voice on the radio or hearing your voice, maybe they're seeing your, vo your face uh, from that sound. When I hear a, a trumpet, it's always bright red. Yeah. So uh, when I was at, at the symphonies, I, they brought the house lights down. I thought it was to intensify the colors I was seeing when various instruments were played. The woodwinds are wow. blues and greens. Yeah, and uh, you know, um, Billy Eilish, uh, she's a synesthite. Walt Disney was a synesthite. Uh, Fantasia is uh, an acronym. It was used for, as synesthesia. Uh, so uh, yeah, I'm in good keeping. Uh, and I understand <laughs> a lot of artists, you, you know, you see things differently, but it's but it's interesting to understand that you provided some pictures to us to illustrate yes. your process. We're, we want to know about that. Walk through your process and and how it comes together. We've got it on screen. Yes, now. well, yes, you can see there it is a a, a mess, and it's a, <laughs> a, a it's a great mess. And that's my studio. There's a, you know, Margaret, uh, to be able to paint and create things in this world of McDonald timelines is a great challenge, and. Uh, I find that music is, is, has been my muse since I was a, a child, and it continues to be my muse. Whenever I hear these uh, various instruments or, uh, or um, uh, songs, um, and go. so I, I, I use that as a, as a muse. Well, it's fascinating. So you, you're going to paint music on a large, large scale during Dark Side large of the Moon, scale. painting to Pink Floyd. We'll have those details on screen at the end, but right now, a very, very condensed version, kind of you to figure out how to make this work in TV time. Yes. You asked us to select a song for you to use That's right. as preparation. So we went to the library of licensed music that we could use. We're okay. going to cue it up and uh, and begin, make it your muse. This Can is you a very it? condensed version. Very, very condensed. condensed. Take I'm it away. Jump in. Okay, here we go. I'm going to try something here. We're going to use both hands this time. Um, I'm going to... The left of the easel. There we go. Is that good? Perfect. Shake them up. It's never too late to see the sunlight. You never know where you're going to go when the train leaves the station, Margaret. And that's, <laughs> like what, that? that's what's exciting about it, you know. You just have to go with it like a child would with a box of crayons and, uh, and not worry about it. And that's the tough part, just letting, letting loose a lot of people can't do, but you, you feel it and you go. Margaret, let me ask you how much time do I have? About a minute. Okay. Here we go. We're going to get a little purple in there. Picasso said we're all born artists. An elementary school child will raise his hand, the whole classroom, everyone in there is an artist. High, high school, maybe one. Social conditioning stifles that creativity. Here we go, and now we're gonna add some of this. And you harness that creativity. I can't imagine what you could do in a course of a, of a longer block of time, <laughs> but in our last 15 seconds here, this is incredible. 15 seconds. Yeah, we're going to have a great time at this show, Margaret, because I feel the energy and the spirit of the people that are in the audience, too, as I'm feeling this music that you've selected here, even though I'm not familiar with it.
your art is a gift and for you to share with us a piece of this process and do this. This is amazing. Rick Stanford, thank you so much. <laughs> that was a real pleasure. See you at the show, Margaret. Fantastic. A painting life for us, Dark Side of the Moon. The show is July 27th and 28th. The location is the Ring O' Fire Agency, 1105 West Bramlett Road. Tickets through Eventbrite. Imagine what that's going to be on a huge scale. Just incredible. We're going to link the information on accesscarolina.com. We're back right after this.